This guy got two Draconic Visages and 100 KC. He said, I dropped one for you. <laughs> Since I don't have it. I want to go back to Mithril Dragons today. I actually want to get a Dragon Full Helm because I hate looking at this helmet. And it would provide so many defensive bonuses. But before I do that, I want to use up all the planks that I have. Also, some Mahogany Logs. Because I just want to get more construction experience, you know. Alright, refresh from 32 million to 36. Woo! Okay, now it's uh, Mithril Dragon time. Now, let's say I don't get a Dragon Full Helm for a very long time, like weeks. And I do other activities in between. And I complete 250 Slayer tasks. So I no longer have to get anything on a Slayer task. There's still two things that I have to be on a Slayer task. Mithril Dragons, because they only give noted Mithril bars if you are on a Slayer task. Once it finishes, it's unnoted. Oh, and also instead of Fire Cape, I'm using Ardon Cloak. Because it gives more prayer bonus and also gives accurate and as you can see it's fairly accurate in general on these dragons but there's going to be quite a few zeros sometimes you see this this okay this one is going really fast but yeah it helps overall you see well, actually it, just, it was a very fast skill it usually doesn't go that fast anyway i'll be right back once i get like 10 shoot bones and then we can start using them i actually got very lucky in these bones i killed only 180 mithril dragons and i got eight Chewed bones. That took like an hour and a half. Well, I guess it is time to go back to Mithril Dragons once again. 39 kill count. Or I guess Spirit Slade. Oh, like three hours later. Let's use another eight bones. Come on, just give me the full helm. I wanna go for Visage, but I don't wanna do it at Mithril Dragons. The drop rate is 1 in 10,000. The red dragons that drop it in 1 in 5,000. And then triple drop rate comes in. I swear when the day will come when I will see that red full helm drop into my inventory. I will be so happy. <laughs> but this was the last bone. I've killed 500 in total. So if I kill 500 more today. I should get 16 more bones or so. According to the drop rate. 47 spirits laid in total as of now. Okay, so I've done over 700 Mithril Dragon kills. As you can see, this is the total loot. In total, I've done 1,700 kills. I got six or I guess five two bones left now. Let's just go for the last round. I want to do something else after this one. I, I grinded long enough for this. Come on, last bone, baby. No. <laughs> 53 spirits laid in total. Let's teleport out of this place. So now since I've done a lot of these tasks, I actually gained a lot of points. I already unlocked the rune pouch, but there's more things to buy like the herb sack. Now initially I didn't want to buy it because I never really used it actually in the main game. You know, I just don't like collecting herbs. I think seeds are the way to go. You need to spend way too much attention collecting them. However, herbivore, right? When you're doing that, it's very nice to fill. I don't know if it's automatic filling or not, but... I'll be catching the 750 of them eventually. Not gonna do that now, but I'm gonna buy it so I don't lose points somehow. I looked around the whole list. There's nothing else you can unlock that's beneficial. Maybe like, I guess, extending uh, Abyssal Demons or Vivan, something like that, because it doesn't matter at some point. You know, I have 150 tasks completed. I'm, I still have 100 to go. But after that, it doesn't matter. It's better to extend then. But not currently. Currently, I'm gonna keep it. The way it is. So what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to do something crazy. It's going to take me a long time, probably like 15 hours. Good thing is that uh, I still have a few hours today and tomorrow I can spend the rest. So it's not too time tight, you know. I'm going to go for Tazar. I'm going to get task each time I'm killing the Jad. Yes, switch to it. Now I'm already at 29 million Slayer experience. It doesn't matter at this point. It's not about the Slayer experience. It's about the pet chance. It becomes 1 in 100 instead of 1 in 200 when you're killing Jads. And there is a task to kill 5 Jads. I think 10. But I know that the maximum is to kill 30 Jads. It still gives you like 250 points. So actually there's 750 points to be claimed from Jad. Elijah and Spirit Shield is going to be coming in. Staff of Light. Because, yeah, yeah, probably I'm going to be AFKing that thing. Also, not only do you get 750 points for all of this, but also if you get a pet, which is very high chance, actually. If you don't get it in 27 kills, 1 in 100, like I said, you can also gamble the fire capes. So I have probably overall like 50% chance of obtaining a pet. That pet would give another 250 points. So in total, this could be 1,000 points if I spend 15 hours in this place or so takes approximately half an hour so we've got two jads an hour 20 jads in 10 hours yeah i should be finished by tomorrow 
to this AFK time. I'm wondering how AFK this is going to be. Could I just leave it? Like, Rangers don't actually hit that much. So, first KC, 33 minutes almost. It took me to complete this one. Okay, what's the current KC? Four. All right, 26 to go, baby. Wait, is this going to be the case? I just got a new task. I cannot enter the cave, I think. Daily? But I just want to do another... I, I didn't, like, come, come in and out. I just completed it. And then I, I cannot do it. Now I have to wait. Oh, there we go. Five times, 250 points. Actually, I thought that, that was 100 points. But yes, you can see the completion time is longer by almost 10 minutes, actually. I still like to do it this way, though. Kill Jad 15 times, 250 points. Still no pets. I feel like I'll have to gamble the fire capes eventually for the chance of pets. So 15 to go. I cannot enter the caves again, by the way, for like three minutes or so, even after I get the task. So I kind of just killed these. I never got anything from them, but, you know, maybe an obby drop and then I can sell it. Get a little extra taco. Also, I'm getting 8,000 per completion of the fight caves. So that's going to add up. Wait, I'm going to do uh, <laughs> elementary school maths. 10 is 80,000. Yeah, it's going to be like one onyx pretty much for free. Okay, so since this is going to be the last run, I want to show you how it feels like on the last waves. It's actually fully AFKable as long as you have prayer. And as long as you use the staff, it's not fully necessary, but it actually helps you just to be like, uh, you know, I know that for one minute, I'm like immortal in this place. Now, I know I showed this a little bit before, but I didn't have Ellie at the time. And Ellie seems to be helping a deal. Do you see how easy it was? Like the whole caves? It wasn't just lucky. I'm full HP. It's pretty normal even in very high waves currently it's wave 57 wait a new one's gonna spawn and i afk by the way i don't do anything i've been listening to these sounds of fight caves for the whole day today it's currently 4 a.m i've done 29 kc so far this is going to be the last one but yeah look at this ranger shooting at me no problem now at this point i would do this drink the prayer sometimes it switches targets as you see i'm gonna drink another one and that's it. Use the staff. One minute AFK. That's it. I can just leave. Nothing will happen. There can be male airs on me, rangers, anything. It will not matter. Even this guy. It just doesn't hit much. I don't know the max hit is like... Well, it should be 20, but then Ellie comes in. And, but it's not always, you know. But in most cases, the rapid heal just heals back whatever you lost. Like, I just got hit too, let's say. And it's gonna be... Bam. It's 9 to 9 again, basically. Yeah. It's, it's it's easy basically now i didn't get the pet yet this is like the last chance to get, try and get it on task one in 100 chance after this i'm gonna have to gamble 27 fire capes you know you can actually sell the capes for tackle so if i get the pet earlier it would be wise to just sell them for tackle but also it's not that much money like i just need two z knights that's all so two more onyxes and i will actually I don't know how much tackle I have. I'm going to check it after. Yeah, this whole thing. L look at this. Wait, maybe. Oh, yeah. 250 tasks or uh, 250 points. I forgot about that, actually. It should show how... Yeah, I killed it in 13 seconds. Oh, dude. It's like those videos that I made. I think I made a couple of videos in the past where I was uh, gambling all these capes. And actually, I got the pet in one of them, but not the other one. I've done two full inventories. Okay, it's only 8,000 tackle. Wait, how much tackle I collected in total? I had some before, but yeah, that's gonna be like one nice onyx that I don't have to pay for. Well, let's do this. Yes, I know. You're not lucky. The, the chance is one in 200. It's less chance and, uh, than what I had now by just doing the tasks. I could actually not read the text even. First of all, I can hear the sound, but also the thing will pop out. For the boss pet you know 250 points come on make the sound pop out <laughs> i don't want to go to chaos elemental to get the boss pet it's one in 300 there so it's not that bad but i just don't like the boss that much teleports you everywhere i have nothing to gain from chaos elemental anymore all right last one wait okay i, I do have one on me actually this could have been good in worldy because i could bring fire cape deep in worldy if you lose it then it's lost actually you don't get it in the grave if it's too deep in the worldy. All right, let's go. That's it. Oh my God. <laughs> this took ages to make. Like all the kill count, mithril dragons, everything. And in the end, I got nothing. Well, except I completed a bunch of tasks. So that's good. 
I gained like uh, 750 points basically. Didn't go up that much compared to previous, but I, you know, we have tomorrow. We'll see what's gonna happen. Anyway, thank you very much for watching. I'm logging off. I'll see you probably in two days. We'll see. It's 4 a.m. now. I have to go to sleep. Good night.